what's up guys so if you didn't see in the intro or in the title of this video i will be doing a q a and yes now i finally have intros on my videos i finally figured it out you guys are welcome okay let's get into this q a first question is from um this one kid we're just gonna say this one kid i like because i don't think he'd be okay if i said his name and hello sydney hi Guys, don't mind this. It's just, I'm in that. Okay, moving on. So, the kid I like said, because I don't know if he's okay with me using his name, is the first, he has a few questions because I asked him. He said about like eight. So, here we go. Here's the first question What are your favorite movies of all time? Let me think about all the movies I hate first. Sniper. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Okay, so Sydney was right. I do like the movie American Sni Sniper. I also, my favorite of all time movie would probably have to be, oh, what? I'm trying to think of the movie I always watch. Here, hold on. Let me ask Sydney real quick. Okay, so I don't watch a lot of movies all the time. Like, I don't. I do not at all watch a lot of movies at all the time, but that's because I really don't like movies. I like Netflix series, and that's better. So, um, I'm going to say Outsiders, because I really love the book, and I love the movie, so we're just going to say The Outsiders. You're welcome. No, or Eight Seconds. No, I don't, I don't know. Okay, we're just going to say I don't have a favorite movie, because I don't want them a lot. Okay, next question. It says, how long have you done Pig for H? Okay, I've done it for six years. This is my sixth year. It's my last year, too, guys. I'm so sad. Don't worry. There'll probably be a vlog of me working on 4-H things and stuff because I want to savor it. No? Okay. Okay. <laughs> What's your kind of day? Okay, we're just going to say the kid I like. I can't date till I'm 16, so. Same. Same. Just keeping it out there. Okay, um... What's my kind of date? Like, the first date, I think you could, like, I'd love to lead a pig around. Just work with pigs. That sounds fun. Or, like, I don't know. Go paintballing. I've never done that. Like, do something new. I, I don't know. Like, the second date, I think you could, like, go on a walk. And, like, at the end of the sunset, you could, like, kiss it and just be over it. No, I'm just kidding. You could go on a walk. Like, the second day, you should go on a walk and just talk, because you're well, learning more. I don't know what the first day would be. The first day, you kind of just get to know each other, so no. just do a thing where you can talk and, like, really get to know each other. So it's probably, like, get dating. I don't want, I, I'm a terrible eater, I though. I ice cream. I can't, I'm lactose intolerant. <laughs> I'm just getting tolerant. <laughs> lactose intolerant. Um, I don't want to get food. I think... I think you could just, how about hang out at the fair? I think that would be, like, a really good first date. Or, like, bowling or something, because, like, you do have, like, times to do that. Like, yeah, just what Cindy said. My favorite kind of date would be, like, one that you can interact a lot. Interact a lot. Yeah, okay. Um, says here, ever done sports? If you have, what sports? Okay, I've done gymnastics when I was five, but I quit, like, after I fell off a of balance beam, so I only did that for, like, a week. <laughs> I've done basketball. I played it. I started in kindergarten. Me and Cindy used to play basketball, but she quit. In yeah, no, we started in Okay, we started in first grade. So I've been, I played basketball first. I'm going to count basketball camps because that's technically... So, I've played it for five years. I've played basketball for five years. Well, if you count the basketball camp I went to my fifth my fifth grade year. But if you don't, I've played it for four years because I played it from first to fourth grade. And then Cindy quit, I think, because me and Cindy used to play. Yeah, after first grade, and she played volleyball. So, I'm just a little bit... Yeah, she played volleyball, and she was a dang good player. She, she, she was having, like... She was... What, we were in, for, yeah. Yeah, yeah, she was in fifth grade, and they were, like, asking her to be on, like, an eighth grade team. No, it was, like, sixth or seventh It was the sixth or seventh grade team, yeah. So, that's cool. Now you know a little bit about Cindy. 
I've also done cheer. I did it for two weeks. And I also did cheer camps. And, this, and I do snowboarding and dance. And that is the two sports I still do. I love dance. I don't think I could ever quit it. It's just... Just something about it. Like sometimes I'm like, why do I even do it? Like I don't even like it. But there's always one thing that's like I can't not do it. Like it's so good. Like I love it. I don't know. It's weird. Okay, so now, um, I want to say this other kid's name. So I'm just gonna say, um, we're just gonna say my guy friend bro. We're just gonna call him bro. Okay. Because I didn't ask any of these people if I can mention their names. So I'm just going to do this for privacy reasons. So, bro, his question was, is a tomato a fruit or a vegetable? I don't know that one. Is it? Because it... Wait, it, there's a tomato on veggies, so it's a vegetable. Cindy answered it. Did you guys hear that? If you didn't, let me repeat it. There is a tomato on veggie tails. So it's a vegetable. Where to go, Cindy? <laughs> She's a smart one. Okay. Uh, we're gonna say my best friend's boyfriend, because that's what this guy is. I just don't want to say his name, because for privacy reasons, yeah. He says, what's your favorite song? Okay, so this became my favorite song right after, like the song I'm about to say, right after my brother's wedding. I was addicted speechless. to this song. Yes, yeah, Speechless by Dan and Shay. Uh, my brother's wife now walked down to the aisle, down the aisle to this song, and I love it. I I don't know if ever someone's off TV so I can play it for you guys, but you know. So, yeah. Wait, hold on. Let's see. I want to copyright it, so I started singing along, and I suck at singing, so I tried to put it in a squeaky voice, and now like you can hear the song. But my voice is in it, so it sounds all squeaky because I put it on, like, hamster mode. Like, ee, yeah. Okay, that was annoying. <laughs> Moving on. Wait, hold on. My dog needs to be let out. So, we're just going to say my cousin because I don't want to say his name for personal reasons. So, he says, who is your favorite cousin? And he's, like, saying this out of all my other cousins. I would have to say my cousin, what we call her, because she, like... Uh, we'll call her, we're just gonna say Tan. So if your name's Tan, I'm sorry, but I mean my cousin, she has a different name. Her name's not Tan, but we're just gonna do that for privacy reasons. Um, who do you miss the most? I think he's meaning like this out of his family since it, my cousin, since they moved to Washington. So, I would have to say, I miss, I miss my cousin the most. Like, honestly, I used to talk to him so much, but, like, the second person I miss the most is Kay. I'm just going to say Kay, again, for privacy reasons. And my little sister is calling my name, so hold on one sec. I'm back. So, guys, thank you for watching this q and I hope you like it, and please give this video a huge, mega, awesome thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to me guys we're at nine subscribers and i freaked out a little bit over nine subscribers that's how sad i am that's just so sad okay and tune in to next week's videos uh yeah if i do videos i think i'm gonna do something like q a mondays or something that sounds fun like i don't know i think that'd be good i think i'm gonna do that it's what do you guys think? Just give me some feedback on that. Do you guys want Q&A Mondays? Okay, this is not turning out like the ending for this video. But like I said, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. And I repeated myself. So, peace. Bye.